Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. What I'd like to do is show you how to simplify this, uh, uh, this expression using our rules of exponents. So when simplifying an expression using your rules of exponents, you know there's a lot of rules of exponents. The product rule, the quotient rule, power to product, power to quotient, power rule, and negative exponents, so forth. So basically what I would like to do here is I notice that um, whenever I have a, an expression, raised to a power, I'm going to want to, and you can see that each and every term is being separated by the product, I know I can use the power to product rule. Now, when I distribute this, right, that's what the power to product rule states, is basically what I'm doing is, not only am I like distributing it, like multiplication distributing, but what I'm doing is I'm raising each and every one of these terms to that power. So if I have x to the fifth raised to the second power, I'm going to want to write it in that format. So basically what I mean is like 3 squared times x ah, x to the fifth squared. So you see how what I'm doing is when I distribute, the power to product rule tells me to kind of distribute that as a power. And then this would be 2 to the third and x to the seventh to the third. So therefore, I can see that each one of these is being raised to that power. So therefore, um, now I can use the power rule. Or here, I can just simplify 3 squared as 9 x to the fifth 2 is going to be x, or x to the fifth raised to the second would be 5 times 2. 2 cubed would be um, 2 to the third, which would be 8. And then this would be x to the 7 times 3. So therefore, now I can rewrite this as 9 times 8. And then this becomes x to the um, 5 times 2 is 10. And this becomes x to the 7 times 3 is 21. Now, again, when I'm multiplying, I can multiply 9 times 8. That's 72. And when I multiply exponents, as long as they have the same base, I add their powers. So therefore, I have 72 times x to the 10 plus 21. So my final answer is 72 x to the 31st power. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you simplify using your rules of exponents. Thanks.